Our top story tonight, a farmer in Jones says that someone destroyed over two acres of his crops overnight. Fox 25's David Chasanoff joins us live from Riziki Farms where this happened. So David, how did this all go down? Wayne and Wendy, Michael Riziki says someone sprayed something on his crops, something he says he believes could cost him his entire business. My spirits are crushed. Riziki says most of his farm looks like it's been under a chemical attack. Devastated right now because everything that I've worked for for the last several months, you know, 16 to 20 hour days, everything I've given up, everything, all my freedoms for this farm should be upright like this. And you're seeing the top, these leaves, but they've all just laid over. All of his sacrifices stopped. vanished overnight so after Riziki says someone sprayed something over his crops. Messing with me is one thing. Messing with my customers who happen to be my friends. I, uh, I take it very personally and it's more than wrong. It's, it's um, disgraceful. His farm feeds more than 100 families every week. But now just about every crop on his property is curled up and dying, if not already dead. I feel like I could have lost the trust in all my customers for the future. So, I mean, whether or not I can salvage this season or not, I'm just not certain that my uh, position as a farmer and in my um, career choice is going to be uh, in question at this point. Riziki says what happened could cost him anywhere from 80 to $100,000 of business. As far as giving up, I'll never give up. Uh, we're just going to do with the farm what we can right now at this point and try to make it better from this point on. And Riziki says he could use some help picking up some of these crops. If you'd like to help, you can call the number on his Facebook page. And we are told there is going to be a GoFundMe page to help him out. When we find out that link, we'll let you know. Reporting live in Jones, David Chazanoff, Fox 25 News.